Hello, I'm Ken Mitten. I'm just looking at my daughter's uh, Honda CRV. If you get a check engine light come on, it might be an oxygen sensor or something. You don't really need to get a scanner. This is a 2001. There is a larger port here for a scanner. You can get a scan tool if you want from Walmart, plug into this, this port and read the codes. But there's also usually this other two pin blue connector it has a little housing it clips and stores into but it doesn't really go anywhere because this is for reading off the dash uh, the dealer will just have a little plug that snaps on here and jumps these two terminals you can just use a paper clip so this two terminal plug it'll be in i don't know maybe 2005 and, and earlier models uh, you might have this port available and it can be anywhere, usually in the passenger compartment. This one happens to be near the center console. If you jump that, then when you turn the car to not to the start position, but just to the power on position, if you have any codes, in this case right now we don't have any, you'll get flashing lights. And so like your check engine light, can flash and it'll flash long flashes and short flashes so they're two number codes say like 65 so if you see six long flashes and five quick ones that would be a number code the long flashes are always the first digit of the number you might have more than one code so you can keep writing them down until and counting them until you see all the numbers or they're just repeating and then you've got the codes you can just go online and look up your honda codes to see what it's reporting might be a problem. And that's about it.